Hey now, mess heads. Welcome back to Mez Town. We're going to check out Sin and Punishment Star Successor on the Wii. And we're going to check it out in its glorious 60 frames per second. Please, y'all, uh, check it out on uh, the Google Chrome there, on YouTube there, and set the quality to 60 frames per second to properly enjoy. This game is freaking awesome. Really good. In normal mode, we're going to do stage one. Let's check it out. We'll do it as Isa. Because Kachi sucks. Yeah, it's kind of like Space Harrier, except it's, except Space Harrier sucks. So, like, if you took Space Harrier and make it a good game out of it. Whoa, snap, I just, I went there. I just said that. Learning the cutscene is all about the action. <laughs> so you shoot with the B button. You aim with the pointer, the remote, the Wii remote, and you move your guy with the left analog stick on the nunchaku, the nunchuck. Your Z button is dodge. See. When you're doing that, you're invincible. You're invulnerable. You cannot be hurt. By holding down the A button, you can charge up a powerful blast shot. Uh, but you see your bar there in the middle. It tells you how often you can charge it up. See how it's recharging now? That circle is filling in. Yeah. By tapping B, you do your sword attack. Because what would a Japanese shooter game be without a sword, right? Ah, I love the Japanese. They're fine folks. They're a proud people. Big part of the game is dodging. Dodging with Dodgerton. And a good tip for this game when you're playing is if you can't figure something out, it might involve tapping your sword button. Disable the threats that are shooting at you the most. First, I find, is a good way to go. Pia! 60 frames, baby! So whatever you target with your, uh, your charge up with the A button, the big bomb shot, it, it does a tremendous damage, but it also does quite a bit of damage to any shit uh, near it and around it as well when your little target reticle is sort of red you're you're uh, hitting a target yeah yeah graphics are unbelievable I mean, this is a Wii game over here we got digital upscale we're playing on the Wii U so it's uh we're 720p right now uh, with the HDMI connection, so maximum possible video quality. Booms! See that damage? Big damage. Waiting for my thing to recharge. Boom! That's how it's done, baby. Now, if you play with the other character, what it does is your charge shot can target multiple enemies. Boom, 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 as you hold it down. Kind of like in res. But it's weaker. To do the big damage to the bosses, you gotta have this guy. But hey, it's a matter of preference. Also, with the other character, which I don't like, it locks on to shoot. So once you hit a guy, it'll keep shooting that guy until the guy dies. So, and right now I can move and shoot whatever guy I want. So it's kind of a noob character. But if you're awesome like me, then you want to use this guy. The levels are long, the bosses are huge. This game was just amazing. 
best uh, rail shooter in the Wii. By far. By far. It's no contest. Not even close. No contest. -y. See, remember that invincible dodge is that's key. And using your sword to reflect things. And waiting for the right moment to strike with your bomb attack. Boom, boom, boom. Die, motherfucker. Boom. Smell you later. Your first time playing through, I definitely recommend play on easy. Because it's like easy is hard. Hard is very hard. Or normal is very hard. And hard is fucking insane. Basically, the hard level, this is the Asian difficulty. If your eyes are round, you need not apply. Round eye need not apply for hard mode. Oh! Lots of shit everywhere. We skip the tutorial level because it's kind of boring. Technically, stage is zero. Is the tutorial level. You can play for score, or you can play for achievement. The game used to have online leaderboards, but since the Wi-Fi connection is no longer available, it no longer does. Uh-oh. I'm taking a bit of a pounding. It's the Autobot Moon Base is really taking a pounding. One arm dead. Oh, you gotta be on your toes. Brothers, be on your toes. When in doubt, dodge attack or dodge your button. You can go right through laser beams if you're dodging in this world. Makes sense, right? It's it's a brain fuck because you're moving your guy with your left hand, but your right hand is aiming. All the while you're looking around for threats. It's really is satisfying when you get good at it, but it's extremely hard at first. You train your brain to be able to do that. Moving independently. You know? With both hands. Come on, red. Er, boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Ain't it great to be crazy? This thing's got to die soon, right? It's got to. I'm doing shitty, folks. I want to show you how awesome I am, but but I've been doing shitty. We're at a boss. Hopefully, I can survive. Kaboom! Come on, fellas! I'm not a scur. It's usually some big damage if you can, uh, if you can hit him with your sword. Yeah, baby! I picked up some health. Kick ass!
I was scared I was gonna die there. Let's take a breather in here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So soon, there's no escape from the nebulox. There's no escape from the nebulox. But you wanna come back for more? Shit, did I actually hit him? Or that ball thing? Bunch of bullshit. Yeah, knocked his back at him. Back at you, homie. Back at you, homie. Mm hmm. Eat sword. It is a sword. If you aim just right, it'll, it'll hit him and, you know, damage him. Death. We killed him. Now that was the easy boss. Now it's time for the hard boss. It's all bosses and bosses and bosses. You gotta aim the centers. It's hard. Ugh. Look up our health. Awesome. Look at those graphics, man. Real nice. Yep, just when you can think you can't dodge them all, bust out your sword. Time it just right. Boom. Headshot. That's right, I slapped his hands with my sword. <laughs> no, 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 give me another. Ah. Motherfucker! Fuck. I hate this part. Just sort of go the way he goes. I try to get hit. I gotta kill this motherfucker. Put his head in his 
like a turtle. Put his head away. Oh, I made the noise. Bloop. That means my... Yeah, my nuke is ready. Boom! Dead. You wait for the sound of that. Oh, no. One death, not bad. It's probably my best run ever, I think. That's stage one of S Sin and Punishment Star Successor. Y'all gotta get this game, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, I don't wanna upload, no. There is no upload feature. Yeah. Maybe someday we'll check out Sin and Punishment Star Successor Stage 2. Later, motherfuckers!